Hey Smart Users, Kyle here again and today I'm going to show you the new Smart Podium 500 series interactive pen display. This model comes in two different versions. One is the SP518 which comes in an 18.5 inch display and the other is the SP524 which comes in a 24 inch display. The Smart Podium display provides a responsive and accurate digital writing experience that can turn any area into an interactive collaboration space. The new Smart Podium has a new smooth tilt stand that allows you to adjust the height and angle of the display. The tool button on the top bezel are also backlit so it's easier to use in low light conditions. These tool buttons are divided into the application tools which enables you to launch smart software the pen tools, which allows you to easily select digital ink color and the eraser tool, and the support tools, which enables you to orient the Smart Podium display. Each model comes with either Smart Meeting Pro on a Smart Go Wire auto launch cable for business, or Smart Notebook collaborative learning software for education users. If you have Smart Notebook software installed, press the application launch button on the display's application toolbar to open it. If you have the Smart Go Wire, Smart Meeting Pro will automatically launch when you connect it to the display. Select a digital ink color using the pen toolbar and write notes on the interactive screen over any application or website. To erase digital ink, press the eraser tool button on the pen toolbar and erase the digital ink. Smart Podium has been designed to work with Microsoft PowerPoint's Presenter View, a tool for using multiple displays to present. Let's take a look at how you can use the presenter view with the Smart Podium to keep your audience focused on the main display while you maintain a private view for your whole presentation with speaker notes. When you open your presentation file, the view on the Smart Podium display will show you a preview of the presentation slide, any presentation notes you have entered, a timer for the presentation, and a thumbnail gallery of the whole presentation. You can write or draw on each presentation slide your annotations will appear on the presentation your audience is viewing while you maintain a private view. To advance to the next slide, simply press the forward arrow with your pen. So that's it for this week. If you'd like more training on this or any other subject, there's a link in the bottom bar to the Smart Training page. As well, if you haven't seen my last two videos, they are here. Make sure you join the conversation on Facebook or Twitter. The links for those are in the bottom bar as well. And see you next week. Class dismissed.